兄弟姊妹，感谢主，咱有这个机会，通个再来敬拜咱的上帝。四篇一百五十篇第六节有安尼讲：，恁就俄罗斯耶和华，凡有知识的，拢俄罗斯耶和华，恁俄罗斯耶和华，咱三甲来敬拜俄罗斯，咱的上帝。全定在十字架。
放下来，满足我心里一切的渴慕。这就是耶稣的爱，耶稣的爱，永远不更改。深刻的爱，将我心。耶稣爱，耶稣的爱一直都存在。我只要你，深刻的爱。耶稣的爱比海洋还要深，比众山还要高。比生命更美好，耶稣的爱没有人能代替，找到却不放弃，耶稣我的唯一。那个你提白上帝，我也感谢你，因为你的听，因完未改变，感谢耶稣的听，感谢你，好过我曾经验到，你怎样听我，求你帮助我。我发动的我的生活来荣耀你的名，我那尼基督是靠主的生命救，阿门。兄弟姊妹，大家好在起，真欢喜会当过一摆来主日，甲大家三甲来分享上帝话语。Brothers and sisters, good morning. Uh, thank the Lord for having this opportunity again to share God's word during Sunday. Na kita di sini, kita akan belajar dari Ayat 1 sampai Ayat 10. Kita akan belajar dari Ayat 1 sampai Ayat 10. Kita akan belajar dari Ayat 1 sampai Ayat 10. Kita akan belajar dari Ayat 1 sampai Ayat 10. Kita akan belajar dari Ayat 1 sampai Ayat 10. Kita akan belajar dari Ayat 1 sampai Ayat 10. Kita akan belajar dari Ayat 1 sampai Ayat 10. Kita akan belajar dari Ayat 1 sampai Ayat 10. Kita akan belajar dari Ayat 1 sampai Ayat 10. Kita akan belajar dari Ayat 1 sampai Ayat 10. Kita akan belajar dari Ayat 1 sampai Ayat 10. Kita akan belajar dari Ayat 1 sampai Ayat 10. K
求你拯救这瓦口，你的仆人。主啊，求你怜悯我，因为我归你求告你。主啊，求你让仆人心内欢喜，因为我的心仰望你。主啊，你本为良善，乐意赦免人有奉行的阻碍，适合还求告你的人。耶和华啊，求你留心听我的祈祷，随听我困求的声音。我的患难的日子要求告你，因为你必应允我。From verse one to verse seven, hear me, Lord, and answer me, for I am poor and needy. Guard my life, for I am faithful to you. Save your servant who trusts in you. You are my God. Have mercy on me, Lord, for I call to you all day long. Bring joy to your servant, Lord, for I put my trust in you. You, Lord, are forgiving and good, abounding in love to all who call to you. Hear my prayer, Lord. Listen to my cry for mercy. When I'm in distress, I call to you because you answer me. 第八到到第十三节，主啊，诸神之中无通比你的，你的作为也无通相比。主啊，你所做的万民，拢要来敬拜你，因也要荣耀你的名，因为你伟大，你才行奇妙的事。独独你是上帝，耶和华，求你。将你的道指示我，我要照你的真理行。求你，让我专心敬畏你的名，主我的上帝啊！我要一心称赞你，我要荣耀你的名，直到永远。你我的发的主啊，是大的，你救我的灵魂免得极深的阴间。From verse eight to verse thirteen, among the gods there is none like you, Lord. No deeds can compare with you. All the nations you have made will come and worship before you, Lord. They will bring glory to your name, for you are great and do marvelous deeds. You alone are God. Teach me your way, Lord, that I may rely on your faithfulness. Give me an undivided heart that I may fear your name. I will praise you, Lord, my God, with all my heart. I will glorify your name forever, for great is your love toward me. You have delivered me from the depths, from the realm of the dead. Jiangwu人起来攻击我，告知当强辉人超出我的性命，因无将你藏在目中，主啊，你是有怜悯有恩典的上帝，无轻如发生气，并且有丰盛的主爱，跟着圣洁，求你恩我转变，人数我，将你
and will care for him. From verse 1 to verse 7, he mentioned five reasons why he seeks after God. And the very first one is that because for I am poor and needy, it means that he is lowly and he have nothing. Faith and moral conduct goes hand in hand. A person should humble himself first before he has his faith. So an arrogant and a proud person is a person who does not believe in the Lord God. In the Bible, you can be able to see many people who have great faith are a people who are absolutely humble. Just the first one we can say in Genesis chapter 18, you can be able to see when the great sin of Sodom and Gomorrah had reached in God's presence, God will destroy both Sodom and Gomorrah. The and Abraham, for the sake of his nephew Lot, who was living in Sodom, he beseeched God in the presence of God that for his nephew Lot and Abraham acknowledged himself as nothing but dust and ashes. And the second person is a person who had experienced the misery of losing everything he possessed and sorrow of losing everyone whom he loves and he had been afflicted with painful sores and his name is Job. And during his debate with his three of his friends why all these unfortunate things that happened in his life but deep in Job, deep in his heart, he, all, he only has a hope and that God will reveal and speak to him personally. And in the end, God truly revealed and spoke with Job and Job acknowledged himself in the presence of God that he is mean and lowly like a rotten thing. And thirdly, the third person who had led the Israel to its greatest both in strength and power, who is King David. And King David acknowledged himself as being a worm, and Apostle Paul of the New Testament also acknowledged himself as the worst sinner of them all. So, so a proud and arrogant person is a person who had never met God. Only a humble and lowly person is a person who is willing to trust upon God. And there is some there are some believers who don't practice the habit of praying and devotion. Once you ask them, why will they not pray and spend time for devotion? Usually they will not answer you back for being busy or having no time. They will just smile back at you and will, answer, and will not answer anything. But deep in their heart, they have a kind of thinking that is asking it from God. Why not asking it from yourself? Since I can do it by myself, why bother to pray? What's the use of it only by relying on praying and not doing it by yourself? And they believe that everything they possess are a reward from their hard toil and labor. And for them, praying before God and trusting God 
are just an entrusted a kind of support and encouragement and comfort both emotionally and psychologically. So, if you are not a leader, you are not a leader. The most important thing is to do something. You have to go out and do something to face the problem. So whether to pray or not, whether to have devotion or not, are not important thing. What is important that when one encounters problem, face it, look for solution, and solve it quickly. Yah, the Chibe, what Chinja Shin Tong Gong? This is a kind of very strong, strong, very strong, very strong behavior. My dear brothers and sisters in the Lord, I will be very careful to tell you that this kind of thinking is very dangerous and definitely wrong. Because for having this kind of thinking, gradually it will separate your relationship and fellowship away from God, and it will cause you to be proud and conceited. So, in the same way, the Bible says, "Moses came to Egypt and said, 'I will not go into the land of Egypt because I am not worthy of the Lord's presence.'" Just like what happened in Deuteronomy chapter eight, where Moses warned the Israelites, saying, "When you enter the land of promise, be careful to follow every command. Remember the Lord your God." It is because those who had forgotten the Lord, once when they build their houses and settle down, once their herds and flocks grows large, your silver and gold increases, and all you have multiplied, then your heart will become proud, and you will forget the Lord your God, saying, "All these possessions come from my strength and from my power." So, so now in the knowledge, can you just by what is happening? 亲像箴言十六章第十八节所讲的，骄傲来败坏进程，狂心来跌倒进程。In the end, you will fall into pitiful condition of destruction, just as what was said in Proverbs 16:18. Pride goes before destruction, a haughty spirit before a fall. 主耶稣在马太福音的第五章第三节甲咱讲，负心的人有福了，因为天国是因的。Our Lord Jesus in Matthew chapter five verse three tells us, "Blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven." Who this means is, it is saying that God in His own time is not impossible, is difficult, is hard. You can say that you have everything that is for God. Being poor is to acknowledge oneself in the presence of God as nobody and having nothing, but rather being poor and needy. All that I am, all that I have. Comes from God, and they all belongs to God. This kind of spirit, including the spirit in the inner part of the soul, and also the inner part of the spirit in the inner part. This kind of acknowledgement includes the outward physical needs and the inward spiritual needs. This kind of spirit in the inner part of the soul, and also the inner part of the spirit in the inner part. This kind of humility of heart in God's presence is blessed by God and acceptable to God. So, the best people in the world are those who are humble, 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 The word "faithful" here can also be translated as "I'm being loved by you tenderly." Those people, when they believe in God, they will be loved by God tenderly. They will be loved by God tenderly. So when the author deeply believes in his heart that he is being loved by God tenderly, he continued to pray unceasingly before God. So, in the Luke Chapter Eight, the Bible says, "Yahshua." Just like in Luke chapter 18, where Jesus narrated a parable to encourage people that they should always pray and not to give up. Jesus said, "In every one of the scriptures, there is a complete blessing. He cannot be turned away from the other side. But he knows that in the scriptures there is a blessing that can be given to you." Jesus said there was a widow in a town and who had a plea and yet was not able to receive justice from her adversary. She knows there is a judge in town who can be able to help her. But sad to say, the judge is unrighteous. There is very big possibility that the judge needs to be bribed before he will help the widow. 
and yet the widow has nothing. So this is why we are telling you to take the most important thing, the most important thing, because if you don't take the most important thing, you will lose. So what the widow can do is to bother the judge day after day, and in the end, because of the judge could no longer bear her continual bothering, the judge give her justice. Jesus said that God is different from this unrighteous judge because God is good and forgiving, abounding in love to all who call to Him. So the author said, "For I put my trust in you." Because you answer me. The Psalm 123:23 says, "I am the Lord and I am the Lord. I am the Lord and I am the Lord. I am the Lord and I am the Lord. I am the Lord and I am the Lord. I am the Lord and I am the Lord. I am the Lord and I am the Lord. I am the Lord and I am the Lord. I am the Lord and I am the Lord. I am the Lord and I am the Lord. I am the Lord and I am the Lord. I am the Lord. As the eyes of slaves look to the hand of their master, as the eyes of a female slave look to the hand of her mistress, so our eyes look to the Lord our God till He shows us His mercy. 专心仰望上帝，跟对上帝人，以恳切向上帝祈祷是大有功效的。A person who trusts in God wholeheartedly and follows God, his earnest prayers before God is very powerful and effective. 伊是个分裂罪，北国伊是个南国犹太孙，咧北国个伊是个有一个先知伊利亚伊个阿哈最王个孙服侍上帝。When the kingdom of Israel was divided into the north of Israel and south of Judah, there was a certain prophet by the name of Elijah who serves God during the reign of King Ahab of north of Israel. Ahab 拜巴力，伊个夫人人约西别拜。亚述拉，但是伊利亚无妥协的，带来的攻击阿哈王。King Ahab serves and worship Baal, while his wife Jezebel worship as as Asherah. However, Prophet Elijah didn't compromise and rebuke greatly King Ahab. 伊向上帝求无落雨，雨就三日，空了个月，无落日涂下。Elijah asked God not to rain for three and a half years. It did not rain. 然后三年六个月以后，伊利亚的加密沙顶，伊恳切的祈祷，烈火对天而降，印证了伊利亚上帝，这是真正上帝。After three years and a half, after three and a half years on Mount Carmel, he prayed earnestly before God, and fire from God fell from heaven to prove that the Lord God of Elijah is the true and real God. 伊提了四百五十位。巴力嘅先知就决心在涂骹，将面趴伫伊嘅两个脚头中间，一连七百嘅祈祷。The Bible tells us that Prophet Elijah killed 450 prophets of Baal. Then Elijah bent down to the ground and put his face between his knees to pray for seven times. 无一摆祈祷了，伊就找人，嗯，海观看，前六摆被找人拢讲无虾米。Every time he finished praying, he sent his servant to look toward the sea. For six consecutive times, his servant didn't see anything. And on the seventh time, his servant answered, "There is a cloud as small as a man's hand is rising from the sea." He said to the servant, "Go and look at the sea. The sea is as small as a man's hand is rising from the sea." So Elijah said to the servant, "Go and tell Ahab, hitch up your chariot and go down before the rain stops King Ahab." 各位，他说你是阿哈，你有什么款的回应 ？Dear brothers and sisters, in case you are King Ahab, how will you respond? 你真感觉真正奇怪。Maybe you may wonder why. 因为万里晴空只有一小片云，为什么有大雨不来？ As the sky is clear and boundless, and only a small cloud arising from the sea, how will it cause big and heavy rain? And when King Ahab was still thinking, the sky grew black with clouds. The wind rose, and a heavy rain started falling from the sky. 
但是伊愿专心仰望上帝，知影上帝必应允，必拯救伊，因为伊所仰望的是真正上帝。So although the psalmist is poor and needy, and yet he trusts God wholeheartedly, for he knows God will answer him, will save him, for the God whom he trusts is a real, true God. 独一无二，无个造物其他神。Aside from him, there is no other God. As in Isaiah 45:22 says, "Turn to me and be saved, all you ends of the earth, for I am God; there is no other." So, the verse eight and the verse thirteen, the first person to utter a strong voice, he adores God. He adores God. He adores God. He adores God. Therefore, from verse eight to verse thirteen, with a rejoicing voice, the psalmist worship God and the psalmist praise God, saying, "Among the gods, there is none like you, Lord. No deeds can compare with yours." 主啊，你所做的万民，拢要来敬拜你，因也要来荣耀你的名，因为你伟大，你才行奇妙的事，独独你是上帝。And in verse nine to verse ten. All the nations you have made will come and worship before you, Lord. They will bring glory to your name, for you are great and do marvelous deeds. You alone are God. So, God, 上帝稳定。伊虽然一个咧困苦，叫我咧中间，但是因上帝讲，我愿意顺从上帝，尊敬上帝多。Once he pondered upon the the grace of God, in spite of being poor and needy, and yet he said to God, "I am willing to submit and to obey my God." To walk in His way. This remembers us. Ah, this causes us to recall or to remember the condition of Prophet Habakkuk. Habakkuk 应该是主前五百八十六年犹太被巴比伦消灭进前的先知。Habakkuk was a prophet around 586 BC when the kingdom of Judah was conquered by Babylon. 在那时代，犹太的宗教跟着道德拢非常的低落，人敬拜偶像，不服的人欺压信仰的人，不服的代志在规个国家中啊不断的发生。During that period, both spiritual and morality condition of the people in Judah were at the lowest. People worship idols, the rich oppress the poor, and the unlawful matters happen continuously throughout the country of Judah. 身为守望者的哈巴国，为着规个国家的败坏，在上帝面前求上帝公义的审判，临到这个国家。So Habakkuk, as being watchman during that time, due to the corruption that happened in the entire country, in the presence of God, Prophet Habakkuk asked and prayed for the righteousness of God to judge the entire country of Judah. 但是，上帝和守望者的答案竟然是，上帝要吹干鼻。However, unexpectedly, God's answer to Watchman Habakkuk is to send the Babylonians, who were more evil and more unrighteous than the people of Judah, to punish the people of Judah. This is Habakkuk, no one can understand it. And this caused Habakkuk not to be able to comprehend. But the Lord is angry. 巴比伦人最后会受到审判，而犹太人最后又还要得救，要因信得生。However, the promise of God is that in the end the Babylonians will be judged, and the Jews in the end will be saved because of their faith in God. 先知哈巴谷在听完上帝的话以后，伊讲：我只能安静的听候灾难的日子临到，环境的面上来。After Prophet Habakkuk heard the word of God, he says. I will wait patiently for the day of calamity to come on the nation invading us. 虽然无花果树、无花农、葡萄树、无结果子、橄榄树也无会效力，田地也无出牛食，群众减了羊，病来也无了牛。然而，我要因耶和华欢喜，因我的上帝喜乐。Though the fig tree does not bud and there are no grapes on the vines. Though the olive crop fails and the fields produce no food, though there are no sheep in the pen and no cattle in the stalls, yet I will rejoice in the Lord. I will be joyful in God, my Savior. 主要我话是我开来，伊乎我卡紧亲像母鹿个蹄，乎我稳行哩关注。The sovereign Lord is my strength. He makes my feet like the feet of a deer. He enables me to tread on the heights. 
，在无明白的困苦环境中间，想到上帝恩典，先知犹原愿意继续的顺从上帝，尊敬上帝多。In the midst of hardship beyond beyond comprehension, and yet the prophet think of God's grace. He is willing to continue to submit and to obey God. Continue walking in God's path. Satan, seven hundred and eighty-six years old, is thinking of God's grace, and he is willing to obey God. 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 Having no more strength to resist, and yet he seeks for God's salvation to the stage that he was he was able to rise up again and to resist the enemy. The enemy. He knows that he has not been put in the place of God. The psalmist knows that the enemy did not put God. Did not. Oh no, the psalmist did not regard for God. So he has not been put in the place of God. The psalmist knows that. And so he also did not regard for the enemy. He asked God to give him the grace to be able to endure the trial. He asked God to give him the grace to be able to endure the trial. He asked God to give him the grace to be able to endure the trial. He asked God to give him the grace to be able to endure the trial. He asked God to give him the grace to be able to endure the trial. He asked God to give him the grace to be able to endure the trial. 在以赛亚书的第三十七章记载，希西家做犹太王的孙，阿叔王的军队来攻打犹太大军，围困亚罗萨林。In Isaiah 37, there it records when King Hezekiah was king over the land of Judah, the army of Sennacherib, king of Assyria, came up, came up to fight against Judah, and they surrounded the city of Jerusalem. 阿叔王差遣使者去对希西家王讲，唔能够听听你所挖苦的。上帝对你讲白贼话，讲亚罗萨冷必未交在阿叔王的手中。And King Assyria sent his messenger to King Hezekiah, saying, "Do not let the God you depend on deceive you when he says Jerusalem will not be given into the hands of the king of Assyria." 伊讲我的做毁灭的，就是高山哈兰。Did the gods of the nations that were destroyed by my predecessors deliver them? The gods of Gosan, Haran, Rezep, and the people of Eden, who were in Tel Asar? He said, "God, no one can answer him." He just came to the Lord's presence and said, "Yahweh is the Lord. You are the King of the Gods." Once King Hezekiah received and read the letter, he was speechless until he came and spread the letter before the Lord. And Hezekiah prayed to the Lord, saying, "Lord Almighty, the God of Israel, you alone are God over all the kingdoms of the earth." Tell me, ah, he did hear. Say, now, give me a chance. Why is he taught what soldier that young man young shall show day? And Hezekiah said, "Give ear, Lord, and hear. Listen to all the words Sennacherib has sent to ridicule the living God." Yahweh, Asur Long, go and hold the Gog, cut the Gog, to be turned into Hong Yang, from the Gog's skin, from the dead of the dead. And Hezekiah said, "It is true, Lord, that the Assyrian kings have laid waste all these people and their lands. They have thrown their gods into the fire and destroyed them." In in, not is it sin? Not is it man's choice? Is it the chest? Is it the chest? Is it the chest? So he bent down in. For they were not gods, but only wood and stone fashioned by human hands. Yahweh, my Lord, now I ask you to give me the hand of Asur and the hand of the king of the kingdom. They know that you are Yahweh's Lord. So now, Lord our God, deliver us from his hand, so that all the kingdoms of the earth may know you, Lord, are the only God. Then the Lord sent his servant to the king of Asur and the king of the kingdom. The king of Asur and the king of the kingdom were killed by the king of Asur. The king of Asur and the king of the kingdom were killed by the king of Asur. And consequently, on that night, an angel from the Lord went out into the camp of Assyria. And when the people got up, one hundred eighty-five thousand dead bodies. So King Sennacherib withdrew shamefully and returned to Nineveh. 诗篇八十六篇，甲咱讲，亚和华上帝是困苦穷乏人的关顾者。So in Psalm eighty-six tells us that our Lord God is a guardian, a keeper of the poor and needy. 
，伊量身伫下面人有丰富的阻碍，伊伟大而且加奇妙的书。伊有灵敏，有稳定，无轻易发生去，有丰盛的阻碍，加着诚实。Our Lord God is good and forgiving, abounding in love. Our Lord is great and do marvelous deeds. Our Lord is a compassionate and gracious, slow to anger, abounding in love and faithfulness. 信上帝人，确实会当记得上帝对人的做德行，而且做因的黑暗中间，心中依然有安宁的一个卡固。People who believe in the Lord, if ever they will always remember in their heart the goodness, the moral and integrity of the Lord God, it will become the foundation of their tranquility in life during time of darkness. In the Taya, Oam, we don't be out of Hoshong, they come with your lead. Oam, God can be in the Shong, they are back young, long to Satan. It is because darkness could not be able to hide them from God, as darkness and light are both the same to God. 我相信，这也是今仔日咱处在一个真正无平常的时代，咱应该有的明白。I do believe deeply that these are the things that are needed during this abnormal and crisis time, which we need to know to be enlightened and reminded. 你继续今仔日的信息中间有一个感想，爱甲大家分享。In concluding today's message, I have a reflection, and I want to share it with every one of you. 即个生命中间无觉得，伊个上帝面前是困苦、穷乏，伊无所有的人。虽然咧，现实个世界内面，欠在伊拥有真正侪物件，亲像管理，亲像名声，亲像钱财，亲像土地。If in a certain person's life, when one didn't feel the the in the presence of God that he is poor and needy, having nothing, although indeed in the present material world. One had already possessed many things like power and authority, fame and reputation, wealth and riches, house and lot. But in his real life, he was empty and void, like the Song of Solomon. And yet, within him, are empty and void, full of vanity, just like what happened to King Solomon. Solomon, when he was in the end of his life, he was in the midst of the Lord, and he was in the midst of the Lord, and he was in the midst of the Lord, and he was in the midst. In the beginning, in God's presence, King Solomon humbly acknowledged that he don't have that wisdom to govern such great country, and he don't have that 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 discerning to manage such great people of God. 上帝的属意比别人更加多智慧，而且因为伊无为家己求什么，上帝可以补足。So God gave Solomon a wise and discerning heart more than anyone else before and after him, and for the things that he didn't ask for, God gave him wealth and honor, so that in his whole lifetime he will have no equal among kings. 哥哥，你来效法你老爸代表，尊敬我的道，遵守我的律例，改变，我的确让你长一寿。And God even said to King Solomon, "If you walk in obedience to me and keep my decrees and commands as David your father did, I will give you a long life." Solomon, long, yet clearly, he understood that the world is full of joy, but in the end, he did not follow the advice of his father, but followed the advice of God, the Lord, the Lord, the Lord, the Lord, the Lord. We all know that it is true. King Solomon had enjoyed all the earthly pleasures and happiness, but sad to say, he didn't follow as what his father, King David, did in walking in obedience to God and keeping God's decrees and commands fervently with reverence before God. In the world, a young lad found God and followed the Lord. And King Solomon stumbled as he enjoyed the pleasures of the world and he was separated away from God. 外表看来，伊好像就拥有了一切，但是伊内心的世界却是极其的浮空。Outwardly, he seems to have everything that the world could give, and yet inwardly, deep in his heart, was empty and void. 这人对于万人所写的传道书夸出。And you can be able to see his worst condition as he wrote the book Ecclesiastes during the end part of his life. 上我嘞。今日咧，上帝面前，承认家己是一无所有，所有嘅一切拥有，拢是对上帝想出来人。And in contradictory, for a person who admits and confesses that he has nothing in the presence of God, whatever he has and whoever he is, all comes from God. 在人生嘅境遇层面，可能也拄着困苦、穷乏嘅境境界。Maybe in a certain chapter of his life, he had experienced his worst condition of being 
poor and needy. But he had a heart of love. He was a man 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 of love. Or the problem that he's facing, rather, what concerns and very important for him is his Lord God. Just like what happened to Job, as recorded in the book of Job, his sufferings of losing everything he possessed and losing everyone whom he loves. For Job grieved, at, and and what grieved Job most is not losing everything or everyone. 第一，让伊家己艰苦的，唔是所失去的一切，而是伊好清楚，感觉袂到上帝。So here we can be able to see what grieved Job most is not losing everything or everyone. Rather, he couldn't feel God's presence in his very worst and pitiful condition. 这是伊第一大痛苦，上帝好清楚，你温存起来。This is his greatest and foremost sorrow, because for him it seems God hides Himself from him. So he always asks God to come out and speak to him. Therefore, Job always asks God to reveal to reveal Himself to him. Then, God really comes out. God always says to him, including God's creation, including God's creation, but it's not revealed why God is so sorrowful. In the end, God reveals and speaks to him. In the end, God reveals and speaks to him. Job for many things, which includes the creation of God, the Almighty of God, and yet God never mentioned the reason why Job suffers. You think that it's a miracle? You think you have no God related to this kind of thing? It is just that you have no God to say I am the beginning. And what is amazing is that likewise, Job never questioned God about his sufferings, but rather Job always acknowledged before God that he is meek and lowly. He said, "Surely I spoke of things I did not understand." I am in the middle of a storm. 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 Why will Job have this kind of response before God? According to my understanding, according to my thoughts and opinion, Job was joyful in God, his Savior. Because he felt he could not lose everything, he felt he could not lose. It is because God, who seems He couldn't feel or reach out, the God who seems was hidden from Him, had once again revealed His presence to Job. This thing gives full satisfaction to Job. So, my dear brothers and sisters, where was God? Place in your heart. Maybe the time has come for you to quiet down and ponder upon this very important thing. Because this has relation to your present life situation and in the future to come. For me, God is the one who takes care of my life. For eternity, and how about you? The time on, the time can be spent with a few little things. We need to spend some time praying and meditating. During our visitation of some brothers and sisters, especially those who are so physically weak, there are two favorite Chinese hymns in Amoy which we usually sing. The first is "Ji Ho Ping You," which is a song. The first one is "What a Friend We Have in Jesus." And the second one is "God Will Take Care of You." And now let us sing together, "God Will Take Care of You," from stanza one to stanza three. Oh, by Kengu Long Bien Kia Hia. 上帝在照顾你
徛主席的时在岸边，上帝的照顾你，上帝的照顾你，美丽看过，美丽穿落。上帝的照顾你，上帝的照顾你，为主做工唔通失志，上帝的照顾你，路途坎坷危险时时，上帝的照顾你。上帝的照顾你，美丽看过，美丽穿落。上帝的照顾你，上帝的照顾你。凡有所欠唔通挂虑，上帝的照顾你。因为天伯格大不，上帝的照顾你，上帝的照顾你，美丽看过，美丽穿落，上帝的照顾你，上帝的照顾你，上帝。永远的照顾辛苦野人。God will take care those who trust upon Him。愿上帝因着你的对伊的辛苦，祝福你，照顾你。May God, because of your trust in Him, bless you and take care of you. Amen. Amen. Wan tipe shong de tia tang, Yasuo Kido de Shibli Gaiting, Xing Jiu Wan Zhuan Kiu Shou de Wen Dian, Xing Liang Mo Tian de Wen Hing, Yin Chua, Gam Dong, Zhuo Lan Dong Gan Mu Jiu Yi, Amen.